Chelsea boss Graham Potter says his mental health has suffered after he and his family received anonymous abuse following the club's poor run of form. The Blues have won just two of their past 14 games in all competitions and lost to Premier League strugglers Southampton last Saturday. Chelsea says they are offering their full support to Potter and his family. I've had some not particularly nice emails come through, that want me to die, Potter said. That's obviously not pleasant to receive. The former Brighton boss said the anonymous emails had also referenced his family. Under Potter, who was appointed in September following the sacking of Thomas Tuchel, Chelsea have won just nine of their 25 games. You could ask my family how life has been for me and for them. It's been not pleasant at all, Potter added. If you go to work and somebody's swearing abuse at you, it's not going to be pleasant. You can answer it two ways. I could say I don't care, but you know I'm lying. Everyone cares what people think, because we're hardwired to be socially connected. Chelsea say they are offering Potter and his family whatever support they need but that it is a personal matter. The Blues are currently 10th in the league, 11 points off the Champions League places. Speaking before Sunday's Premier League game against Tottenham, Potter said, with the results as they are, you accept criticism. That's not to say it's easy at all. Your family life suffers, your mental health suffers, your personality, it is hard. Potter acknowledged that fans were entitled to be angry with recent results, but he said he would not be undone by the abuse. Life is tough for lots of people, he said. You ask me is it hard, I say yes, it is hard. You suffer. You get upset. When you're in private, you show real emotion with your family. But the world is tough. We're going through an energy crisis, a cost of living crisis. People are striking every other week. No one wants to hear about the poor old Premier League manager. Spurs assistant manager Christian Stellani, who remains in charge on Sunday as boss Antonio Conte continues to recover from gallbladder surgery, believes Potter is a great manager. I studied Potter since I arrived here because he was a manager that was at Brighton last season and I followed Brighton a lot, Stellani said. It surprised me the way they play, the way they changed system many times and the way they were good to challenge with Potter.